All right, here we're going to fix a MacBook that has no power. Let's open up this MacBook and figure out what's wrong with it. So this doesn't give us a light on the charger. Hmm. So let's see why we don't get a light in the charger. We're going to pa turn on Paul Daniels' execrable software. One of the only thing worse, only things that is worse than smashing your head into the side of an SUV that did not turn on their turn signal is using Paul Daniels' software. So the first thing that we need in order to get a green light in the charger, which we don't have, is PP3V42 to be present. Let's see if we have MPP3V42 is present. The next thing we would need is for the SMC to be turning on. The SMC is going to be turning on if the SMC reset signal is present. So, let's see if SMC reset is present. SMC reset is 0.5 volts. SMC reset being 0.5 volts is going to mean that the SMC is not turning on. Now do realize that the SMC is required to get a light in the charger. This is the SMC reset circuit. It's going to allow SMC reset L to be high about a quarter of a second after your power gets to the machine. The whole idea is that PP3V42 is going to take a little bit to stabilize. PP3V42 is going to take some time to stabilize in that rail. PP3V42 is not going to... Um, and that the SMC that runs off of that rail, which is what talks to the charger, is going to crash if it tries to start when PP3V42, which is its main power line, is 2 volts or 4 volts or 8 volts or 1 volt. So SMC reset needs to be held down for a short period of time so that the SMC only starts once PP3V42 is a nice, flat, beautiful 3.42 volts. So let's take a look at what the rest of this board looks like by taking it out of the case. All right, so the pull-up resistor for SMC reset looks fine. The SMC reset chip also looks fine. So we have two possibilities. Behind door number one, the SMC is shorted and pulling it down. Behind door number two, the SMC reset chip is bad. Now I'm going to hope that the SMC reset chip is bad, because if the SMC reset chip is bad, that's easy. If the SMC is bad, that's hard. But wait, there's more. What is this? Hmm. Thank you, Pedro. I appreciate that. Hmm. What? Y you know my birthday. As can be seen, we now have a fan spin. Wow. SMC reset actually goes to the JTAG connector. See here? SMC reset L, the signal that was held down, is on that JTAG connector. All I had to do was remove that JTAG connector, and now we have a working board. MacBook logic board repair. Aren't you so happy that Apple puts that connector right on the edge of the board on the same area that water just e clearly flows straight into the machine instead of putting it on the middle of the board or anywhere else on the board so that when you, any sort of humidity gets near your machine, it doesn't die? Aren't you glad that Apple thinks different, designs different, and doesn't bother putting effort into liquid resistance like IBM did over 14 years ago? That's it for today, and as always, I hope you learned something. Here we have another MacBook that needs to be fixed. This is an A1466 with no power.
Let's open it up and figure out why it has no power and see if we can get it to turn on. If we can get it to turn on, maybe we can shake some money out of it. I will succeed in killing you. I will not try if that goes back in here. Open it in there. But anywhere but here. Give it to Steve, actually. Drop it on Steve's desk. <laughs> Wait, but she's on vacation. <laughs> Monday, I work. Not yet. Not yet. Uh. They know their rights. I hate that stuff. They know they have rights. They read the poster. Don't read the labor poster, Mikey. Labor? Louis, we gotta talk, talk to the stream. Mikey, have you read the labor poster? Yes. And the answer you're looking for lies right here. I am just a figment of your imagination. You Fine, I'll poster? get you a lactating room. <laughs> Wait, what? No. <laughs> you, wanted, you wanted your rights, you get your rights. I'll make you a lactating room downstairs. It's going to be pretty. That's not what I want. I'll make sure it's away from the rats. We're going to plug it into this MacBook, and it appears to not turn on. Hmm, we don't get a light in the charger. I wonder why. Is PP3v42 present? PP3v42 is present. Now we check and see if SMC Reset is present. SMC Reset is... Interesting. SMC Reset is short again. Hmm. What happened the last time SMC Reset was short? What happened the last time that it was not what it was supposed to? Wow. Imagine that. Another JTAG connector. How random. Random? Random. I hope Paul doesn't see this. Another one. <laughs> what are the odds? Murder. Murder just occurred. Now when we plug it in, we get a green light, which turns to orange light, and a fan spin. Another machine where SMC Reset L was being stuck to ground, and all we had to do to fix it was remove a JTAG connector. If you want to purchase a JTAG connector, check us out on store.rossmangroup.com where we sell burned JTAG connectors, authentic burned JTAG connectors that we ripped, stabbed, burned, or axed or knifed off of MacBook motherboards. An authentic MacBook JTAG connector. Mwah! Straight from Rossman Repair. Don't delay, buy today. It's a good luck charm. That's it for today, and as always, I hope you learned something. All right, so here we have another liquid damage MacBook with no power. If this is the third one in a row that needs a JTAG connector, I will have to delete this video because Paul will, will come back and he will murder me if he sees that this was all that was in my queue. Enjoy your vacation, Olga. Thank you. Tagir, see you later. Don't go to Bermuda Triangle. Oh my God. No way. No way. Someone says from a lot of us on the internet, we love you, Lewis. Thank you. That's very nice of you. No effing way. Wow. Again. Again. <laughs> oh my god. This is the best day ever. Wow. This cue is better than sex. This is the third one in a row.
Three in a row. Wow. This is amazing. This is great. This is so awesome. Another JTAG connector. If every day of my life could be just like this, I would be so happy. Just destroying JTAG connectors as violently as possible. This is so cool. I could just live the rest of my life doing this every single day. JTAG connector after JTAG connector after JTAG connector. Die. Die, you bastard. Die. If this gives me a fan spin, I'm, I will shit myself. Hi, hi. Do you think this is going to have fan spin after this? We destroyed the JTAG as violently as possible. All right, so let's see if this thing gets a fan spin now after all of our little adjustments. Light! That was a light on the charger. Beautiful. Works. And if you want an environment to check out these videos with no advertisements at all, you can check us out on boards.rossmangroup.com. And on boards.rossmangroup.com, you can go over here and go repair videos by model or problem, repair videos by problem, and when you click over this thing, it'll show you all of the different problem types, and you can go to something like No Green Light and Charger, and it's going to show you every single video I've ever done talking about no green light in the charger, right like that. Or, if you want to find videos related to just this specific board, which is an 820-00165, you can go repair videos by model, and then click 820-00165, and then you can see all of them. These videos were, um, were uploaded to Vimeo from the original master copy, so they are going to look better. And above all, if you go watch the videos in Vimeo, there's no pre-roll or post-roll video ad. There's no YouTube cancerous comment section. And it's a nice little YouTube-free environment, ad-free environment, so you don't have to watch ads, none of that non nonsense. And uh, that's it for today. And as always, I hope you learned something. With that, I'm going to go and figure out what it is I should be doing with my Friday night most likely going back to my alcohol. I haven't drank in a long time. Hmm. What should I do with my Friday night? Hmm. I should probably fix more MacBooks. <laughs>